Hello and good evening ladies and gentlemen, my name is Sword Darchild, and welcome to the first episode of Let's Replay, no, Let's Play, Octopath Traveler 2. I've pretty much been playing this off screen, hang on the side, just to get the feel of the, uh, anything that's like new battle mechanics, Hicks and, uh, path, uh, moves that they can do in this game. So, I have a little bit of a head start for most of what I can do here. So... Let us get started. And let's see... Which one... of these eight characters... do I want to start with? For what I've read on the topic of this question for this game, it's one of these four characters in the uh, Eastern Continent, and specifically, they go with the thief, Throne. Your name is Throne Agnes, and you are a thief. Your tale begins in a thrilling city in the Brightlands. You are a member of the Black Snakes, a thieves guild that controls the city from the shadows. Your job is to steal and clean. Not again. Not this stench. Every time I breathe it in, it feels as though my very lungs are rotting the stench of blood. Determined to escape the cycle of bloodshed, you embark on a journey for the keys to your freedom. Hmm. We might... actually... Uh, let's not keep everyone waiting and go with her. In my original uh, playthrough of the game, I started with the dancer, Agni. I take what I want. This time, I'm still her. Not again. Not this stench. Every time I breathe it in, it feels as though my very lungs are rotting. The stench of blood. Hurry up, Throne. They're coming. Damn it! The bleeding won't stop! Don't waste your breath. Keep running! We made it. We should be able to get up top through here. What's the matter, Scarachi? It won't open! The damn thing won't open! <sighs> the rats finally caught up to us. Damn it all! This looks serious. Sorry. This looks very serious. Now then, it's time we welcomed our guests. I hate rats. 
Yeah, yeah, I know, breaking my enemies. Be calm. What to do? I know the original basics, so I pretty much know what we're doing. Come on, let's go! My turn. Good job. What a waste of time. I just don't get it. Why is this door locked? Get up, Donnie. It's time for you to work your magic on that lock. Donnie. Something tells me he's dead during that fight. No, no, no. Don't tell me he's dead. This job is a nightmare. Damn it! What the hell is going on? If I had to guess, you have a traitor on your mist. Someone set us up. What she said. Our plan was perfect. We slipped into the Diamante estate and got what we came for. There was no way they could have known to have all those guards waiting outside. Unless someone squealed. And only a few of us knew the plan. Which means there's likely a traitor among us. That's what I said. You can't be serious. Who'd sell us out like that? We can figure that out later. She's right. We have to get out of here first. Come on. There are other ways out of this place. Let's go. Now then. And while I got companions with me for the moment... No vermin's gonna stand in my way. Come on, let's It'd be go. a perfect opportunity to level up off screen to a level that I think will suffice. Be calm. <laughs> Red Hat. <laughs> What a pain. Yes, I think I'll level up a bit before I continue around here. So, uh, I'll be right with ya. Okay, I'm back, and I leveled them all up to level 7, which should be good for the first half of this first chapter. And let's get Throne to learn some abilities. Let's see. Let's go with Swift Step. And I need one more bell so I can learn another. Wait. 
always pays to go exploring. Cannot remove. Okay. Noted. Let's get out of here. I got that chest already. Okay. Wait. What the hell? What's another one of those rats doing here? How are they not hearing you? Because the sewer seems to have great acoustics that can make them hear you from far away through the echo. Must have only come this way. What do we do now? Wait here. I'll handle this. I'm going to give our friend a little surprise. Ah, uh, yes. Path action. Ambush. Her nighttime path action. Good night. Nice work. Your skills are second to none. No wonder you're the best in the nest. He's fast asleep. Didn't even see it coming. Finish him, Throne. No. I'm in no mood for meaningless bloodshed. <sighs> What's your backup plan then? Cheese? Because you're gonna need something to keep him busy when he comes chasing us down this tunnel. <sighs> yeah, we're seven levels up. Uh, we should be fine. That's enough, Skarachi. We have to go. Fine. Finally, a way out. Time to say goodbye to these rat-infested sewers. Hold on. We aren't in the clear yet. Yeah, we've got company. Th Throne, if you've got that cheese, now's the time. Oh, shut up, rat boy. You idiot. Enough about the cheese. We don't focus, we'll be as holy as cheese ourselves when they're through. Right, let's go. These rats just don't give up. And it's up to us to exterminate them. Come on. Alright, boss go. boy. What are you weak to? The axe. How about sword? No? Be calm. Just the axe, huh? My turn. Alright, Rone and Piro, you take care of the minions. You, on the other hand, take care of their boss's shield. One less enemy to worry about. Cleaning time. I'm sorry, but I will hold back. What 
to do. <laughs> I take what I want. Make quick work of that. Whew. Glad that's over. For now. I'll have to come back down here by myself later to uh, level her up more and get more job skills. Take that, you lousy vermin. <sighs> well, what's that look about? You think I'm just fooling around instead of pulling my weight? That it? I didn't say that. Well, I wouldn't have to fool around on my own if someone would give me a hand. Dude, that guy was all you. The rest of them were us. If you know what I mean, Throne. <laughs> give yourself a hand. Are you coming with us, or do you want some privacy? Nice bustling music for the busy city. How about that? Kind of nice. Look, got like a nice jazz feel. We made it. Ah, how I missed these filthy little streets. I would have hated to kick the bucket down there in those sewers. Just like your fallen companion. You mean like poor Donnie? Who did this to us? I wish I knew. Let's head home. The job's not finished yet. <sighs> Those two aren't going to be happy about this. They probably wouldn't be happy regardless of what you say. But, but we we didn't do nothing wrong. Doesn't matter. I'd rather die than face their punishment. We don't have a choice. Not with these collars on. So long as those two hold our chains, we have to obey them. That's crazy talk. I ain't no dog. Quiet, Scarachi. There might still be rats around. Let's split up. They're less likely to find us then. I'll deliver the mark to father. All right. Be careful out there. The Black Snakes. A band of ruffians with connections to the realm's richest circles. They control the town's wealth and power. Sounds serious. And I am one of their minions. My job is to steal and clean. What a filthy town. Time to go home. I'll do some exploring after. <sighs> uh. 
A good dagger is not unlike one's own hand. Flexible, daft, and capable of taking a life with a flick of a wrist. Just like you, Throne. Thank you, Father. We call this man Father. He's the leader of the Black Snakes. A first class assassin who oversees all of our jobs. He took me in as a child and taught me everything I know. The Mark, Father. What is that staff? I hope it was worth Donnie's life. It is simply what we were asked for. <sighs> our client said this would be our last deal, seeing as word of our plan got out. It would appear there is a traitor among us. Among us? You don't say. There may very well be. Just who is the one behind it? Perhaps our nest is in need of cleaning if such filth is lurking about. You have always been different, Throne. Better than the others. You are the only one who has inherited my skills. Then that's a clear sign that you taught her everything you know. Which is why I have nominated you as my successor. Do not disappoint me. <sighs> Lately this collar feels... Tighter than usual, Father. <laughs> you want me to loosen it then? I couldn't if I wanted to. My key alone is not enough. Now speak of it no more. It is a badge of honor. One worthy of a true snake. Yes, Father. Very good, child. I hope you are prepared for tonight's gathering. You know what awaits those who disappoint Mother. Nothing here. I know that way is going to continue the story. Is it all right to be playing like this? We're on a big job. I know you're new to this, but at least pretend like you've got some guts. This is the storage room, but I'm stronger, baby. Must be level 48 to take this guy? Holy cow! I'm 40 levels below him. Hey. I won't be opening that door for a while. They're not worth it. Let's go see the other. I see my adorable little snakes are all here. Let us begin our delightful gathering. We call this woman Mother. She is our other leader and manages the guild's members. She values order and discipline above all. Those who fail her are mercilessly punished and disposed of. Gee. Don't want to get on her bad side. Mother, father, they are our leaders. The forces that move the Black Snakes. Throne, my dear. 
Would you come here, please? Garachi tells me that today's failure falls on your shoulders. <sighs> I worry for our future, dear. The Black Snakes have long controlled this town. But Father and I aren't as young as we used to be. The Snakes will need a new leader to guide them. A successor, as it were. Father has high hopes for you, Throne. But in my eyes, you are still lacking. Now then, time for your punishment. Oh god, she's gonna whip us. Literally. You want Mother's whip, don't you, Throne? Oh, not a peep. A few lashes is enough to bring others to tears. But I suppose you'll need more encouragement. <laughs> you lost us a wealthy client. You've sullied my good name, you wretched worm. Oh, not even a whimper. Let's see how long you can keep that up! Mother. Can't you see I'm busy, Piero? It wasn't Throne's fault we failed. It was mine. If anyone deserves punishment, it's me. I sense no sincerity in you. <sighs> oh, Piero. How noble of you to come forward. I'm moved to tears. <laughs> Yes, what a fine reaction. Just what I was hoping for. In honor of your selfless act, I will call an early end to tonight's meeting. Oh, you can't be serious, Mother. Oh, things were just getting good. Silence, you abominable reptile. Now listen well. I will be leaving our little nest for a spell. Our family is in need of fresh blood. I expect all of you to take good care of our home until I return. Come, Piero. There is a long night ahead of us. Hero. These chains can't be severed. <laughs> That's what you think. Mother has whipped us since before I can remember. I spent my childhood beaten and bruised. I've long since forgotten what pain feels like. I steal what our clients want and eliminate those who stand in their way. That is how I've always lived. It makes me wonder, is pain the only thing I've forgotten? Dark evenings are followed by hollow mornings. The cycle repeats again and again and again. Sucks to be you, Throne. <sighs> yeah. 
Here, eat this. It's a dried strawberry. Are those safe to give a dog? I envy you. Living without a collar, bound to no one. Free to roam wherever you please. I see you made a new friend. I brought you breakfast. You haven't eaten yet, I assume. Thank you. Want one? Least I can do for the best in the nest. No thanks. I don't smoke. Maybe you should. People like us need to take joy wherever we can find it. Yeah, speaking of someone who lives with someone that smokes, that's not joy. I want to live a long life. <laughs> then you're in the wrong line of work, Throne. Eh? Life here is like a cigarette, gone in a puff of smoke. <laughs> you can say that again. We do what we can to survive in this stump. Living with a collar around our necks from our parents. I want to rise in the ranks and get my hands on some real money. Buy good liquor, good smokes, fall asleep in a big bed. I want to enjoy my life before I bite the dust. Sounds nice. And sad. What do you want, Throne? Uh, what do I want? We have to get going. Time for work. Now then. Can't steal yet. Okay. Maybe after we talk to father or mother. Ah, there you are, Throne. Why do I feel like that voice is familiar? I have a job for you concerning our little traitor. Who is it? Scarachi. How can you be sure? He was seen meeting with Diamante. They plan to destroy me and take the black snakes for themselves. What are my orders? Scaracci is on his way to the Diamante estate as we speak. Sneak in there. Kill them both. Scaracci too? Death to traitors. That's the rule. <sighs> to some organizations, yes. <sighs> and I guess that's the rule for this Thieves Guild as well. 
However, Diamante is wary after our last break-in. Security will be tighter. There is a way in, but I don't like it. Tell me. Diamante craves the pleasures of the flesh and often invites women to his estate to sate those desires. You could disguise yourself as a brothel girl to get close to him. You're no stranger to using your feminine wiles, right? I doubt I could convince anyone in these clothes. We are thieves. If there is something we want... We take it. We take it. Understood, Father. I will find myself a suitable outfit to sneak into the Diamante estate. Very good, child. I must leave town to attend business elsewhere. When you have finished your job, come and join me in Winterbloom. Winterbloom? Sounds lovely. Do not disappoint me, Throne. Now to find a disguise. Despite the job we were just given, I smell a rat. And not a very good one. I must find a costume worthy of the role. A brothel girl's clothes would do nicely. <sighs> Yes, we know about the stealing ability. Since we, uh... Do this in, uh, the original game as well. The boats are new. Hmm. And the boats are new too. So you can travel on water. Now then, let's go on a stealing spree. I'll steal from her last. I'll take that. What do you got? Take that. I'll take that. So far, so good. Nothing to steal from him. How about your partner over here? <laughs> oh yeah, we have a new skill to learn. Let's see. Hmm, armor corrosive. That might do. I'll have to level up more to be able to unlock more of her abilities. Let's see about the other townsfolk. What can we steal from them? Feels a little eerie without the music. And I got some money to spend. I'll 
I'll take that. Really? From a young kid, we're gonna steal a candy and a stuffed toy from a child? I'll take that. I'll take that. <laughs> I'll take that. <laughs> Did I just hear a cat meowing? Just curious. <laughs> There's a weapon shop right there. Take that. <laughs> okay, aside from that uh, woman, we've pretty much stole everything we could get our hands on. My disguise is complete. Now, to enter the estate. <sighs> Might as well. Now, where's that file for the th There you are. Now then, let's check out that armory before I go in there. Ooh, hello, I didn't steal from you. I'll take that. I probably just stole everything I need. Let's see. That nameless sword looks good. Bronze knife looks good, but the hand breaker seems better. Can't afford a war axe. Can't even use it. A light buckler. Leather helmet. Bronze helmet. For silver hair piece. That could do useful. I just stole a fur armor. Traveler's mantle. Let's see. An un earring earring. Let's see. Let's see about our equipment. Let's put on that needle dagger. Buckler, leather helmet, and the fur armor. And we got a protective ring and a springly ring. I got two protective earrings. Uh, I think one will be fine. The speed is usually key for a thief. 
now. What's better on the equipment we have right now? I could go for a better sword. I think I'm good with the knife we have at the moment. A leather buckler seems better. Seems the bronze helmet. You know what? Why not treat yourself, Rone? Get that silver here piece. Traveler's mental might do. And... Oh, I somehow took... I accidentally took it off. Okay. And I can't afford any better weapons for the moment. Let's put that armor back on, and then, uh, that should do it. Hopefully we'll get a better sword somewhere along the line. I was summoned by Lord Diamante to entertain him this night. Another brothel, girl. And a pretty one at that. How about entertaining us instead? Keep moving, perps. I'm sure you'll find us more satisfying than the Lord himself. Think again, boys. My apologies. But I doubt you boys could afford my talents. <laughs> Get moving. <sighs> Much better. Were you wearing that under the dress you stole? Now then, before I overstay my welcome. One soldier outside. I must make quick work of him. I have to find Diamante and Scaracci as soon as possible. And try to make quick work of it too. Good night. <laughs> Guess it's nighttime, so the lantern might make sense for it for us to uh, have that on us. I'll take that. Time to clean up the filth. Blessing of Darkness. Athrone to your party at night and turn the tides of the battle in your favor. Throne can grant all allies a tribute rising effects at the start of the battle. Ready? Good to know. Weak <laughs> to the dagger. Please Are you weak to the sword too? No, just the dagger. Ready? My best wait over. Eat this. All tidied up. Hmm. Should I or should I not dare? Let's go for it. I can level up later. Ooh, 
for Shadow Soul Stone. And what's that chest over there? His throat has been slit with a sharp blade. Stab through the heart from behind. A job well done. A long sword. No sense of a struggle. Whoever did this is no amateur. Ooh, a save point. Did you need something? Yes, I do. Oh, I got plenty of those. Wouldn't hurt to buy five more. There we go. Dagger, buckler for armor. I've already got all of those. Let's make a quick save. His face is frozen with fear. By the time he realized what was happening, it was too late. And it looks like the killer tried to break out through the window. You should know better than anyone by now, throwing an A. And Diamante, too. <laughs> Piero? You wield your dagger just like father. I'd expect nothing less from the best in the nest. Piero. Oh, this? You were taking too long, so I decided to clean up for you. Did Father ask you to do this too? Not quite. You see... There was never a traitor to begin with. What? He told you that Scaracci was the traitor, didn't he? He said to come to the Diamante estate and kill them both, right? He did, yes. But you see... Father told me that you were the traitor. Of course he did. And he told Scaracci that I was the traitor. But why? Because that's the kind of parents they are. They planned this whole thing. Kind of dark, isn't it? We're supposed to kill each other off until only the best of us survives. There can be only one. That's how they choose a successor. Some reason there that's giving me big Highlander vibes. Only that with Thebes. Was all part of the plan too. <sighs> Donnie was just eliminated from contention earlier in the process. No. The Black Snakes must change. 
When mother and father's power wanes, people will jump at the chance to take them down. That's why they need to find a worthy successor, no matter what it takes. And that successor will be me, head of the Black Snakes. Well, as they say, take out the head and the body will die. I'll be the one controlling this town from the shadows. And I'll do whatever I must to get there. Don't do this. I don't want to fight you. Sorry, Throne, but I don't think we've got a choice. I'm sorry, Throne. Piero. Has your dagger not tasted enough blood already? Hero. Ready? I shouldn't have leveled up to level it to the level I'm currently at right now with him in my party. But oh well. Now, what are your weakness, boy? Ugh. It's not the dagger. So it's got to be sword. Cleaning time. <laughs> what to do? I'm also curious. Do we know any magic? Shadow magic. Okay. Afraid of the dark. <laughs> Cleaning time. <laughs> My turn. There! Ready? My turn. Hero! Afraid of the dark. Let's see how well we can do on him. There's no reason for us to fight. There is, Throne. You are father's favorite. I cannot be his successor as long as you live. I have to. I must kill you. It's the only way I'll ever be free of this god's forsaken place. I understand, Piro. But I refuse to die here. Latent power. Once the latent power gauge is full, the character can use a unique command in battle. The gauge will fill when the character takes damage or breaks an enemy. You really are the best in the nest. Interesting. <laughs> You're finished. Ready? My turn. <laughs> ah, it's full. Pressing X to activate it. Activate the loading power. You can act twice in a single turn. What to do? Huh. Nah, I think I'll save that for another bit. For the next turn. For now, let's heal. I'll take this. Cleaning time. Watch me! My turn. Cleaning time. Now let's see. Over. Afraid of the dark. This is far enough. Ready? Take this. 
cleaning time. Hero! What to do? You're open. He's almost dead. We got him. Clean time. What to do? My turn. Ready? There! You're finished! This is far enough, Take this! What? Let's finish this. As swift as a snake. <laughs> Ready? I'm sorry, but I won't hold back. Cleaning time. <laughs> what to do? Got him. Take what I want. And leveled up in the process. Awesome. I call it victory. Double victory. <laughs> Not again. The stench of blood. <laughs> You got me good. I should have known. I was no match for the best in the nest. It's up to you now, Throne. You have to be the successor. That's not what I want. Every time I breathe it in. It feels as though my very lungs are rotting. I feel sick. What then? What do you want, Throne? I'm tired, Pyro. I just want... To be free. <sighs> That's what everybody in slavery wants, girl. Hopefully we can help you achieve that. To go wherever I want to go. Free, huh? Sounds nice. But how can you be free with that collar on? Our chains can't be severed. Not ever. You're wrong. I'll sever them and claim freedom with my own two hands. And we're gonna help you. <laughs> if anyone can do it, you can. Right? We're gonna do our very best to help her. Hero. Hero. Shame that we had to kill her friend and working companion. But that sucks. For the first time in my life, I know what I want. 
I want to be free. But first, I need to rid myself of this collar. And to do that, I need two keys. Mother holds one of them. But she left in search of new members. Uh-huh. I must find her if I want that key. Father holds the other. It won't be easy getting the keys from both of them. He has gone to Winterbloom. At least we have a lead on where he is. And wishes me to be at his side during his next job. Finding him will be easy. Killing him will be much harder. But I must eliminate them both if I am to get those keys. Now, where to first? For the first time, I cannot wait to see mother and father. Chapter 1 of Throne's Story. End. And I think in order to help her be able to take down both leaders of the guild, we're going to need trusty companions. So, who are the closest companions we can get? Let's see. There's the cleric right there. And there's the scholar up there. And to the south of us is the huntress. Two out of three should suffice. Actually, all three of them should suffice for the first half of the story of her plus the ability that the scholar has can show the weaknesses of every enemy in the game well at least one at a time anyway so that could prove useful plus they might have both that and the uh, huntress might have certain job abilities that might help with experience and job experience. We should go for the scholar first. And just like the first game, we have a random NPC character that gives us our first side quest named Al. The first game, his name was uh, Kit, I believe. So we just need to get his bag back. That should be a sitch. Why not? Now, where's that thief? <laughs> Let's play. Cleaning time. What's that building over there I see in the horizon? Oh, Iron Blade. Let's go check that building over there. Last thing I'll do for this video. Common 
get me. My turn. <laughs> Cleaning time. Oh, there's the thief. I'll deal with you later. I just want to check out that building. Hmm. What have we here? Number two, stringy boots. Shoes made to supplement the walking capabilities of their wearer. The soles of these quality leather boots have been filled, uh, filled with the strong springs to increase the wearer's stride length and, as a result, their speed. They're not suitable for long-distance travel, however, as they are quite taxed on the body. And is that a catapult? You there. Why, hello! What brings you here? Wait, don't tell me. I already know. You came here to see I, a car, the genius inventor. Come up and come up with the time. Don't look so surprised. My eyes see all. Now, I normally don't do this, but since, uh, since you've shown up in such an interest in my inventions, I shall explain what they do. Feast your eyes on my firstborn. I call it the changeable catapult. It is a highly advanced device capable of launching any object of a certain size, that is. And what's more, one can decide exactly where said object will land simply by he reconfiguring the firing mechanism. Now then, let me turn your attention to my second invention. I call these stylish shoes springy boots. I already read about those. Not only are they beautiful, but with a highly leather finish, they are also very highly functional with springy base heels. These powerful springs give their wearer a boosted speed, allowing them to move exponentially faster than the average person. Alas, it seems that my genius inventions are simply beyond the comprehension of common folk. But you, my friend, are far from common. You appreciate my work, which is why I have a responsibility, nay, a duty to assist me. You must spread her world spread word of my inventions to every corner of the realm. Um, and to do that, you will need this. Proof of the inventor. Oh, we got our first secondary job right off the bat. How about that? So our secondary job, our first one anyway in the game, is inventor. That's a new one for Autopath. With it, you can, you sh even you should be able to reproduce my creations. But before you ask, allow me to put your mind at ease. This is merely the beginning. I have countless ideas about simply lacking materials to bring them to life. Which is where you come in, my friend. 
I have already made lists of what I require her and place them on the material plaques. You need only procure those materials. Now, off you go, my lovely assistant. Use the fruits of my labor to your heart's content. Excellent. And I won't let you down in finding those materials, sir. Anyway, let's set this to daytime, because... For what I hear in this game, the harder enemies come out at night. So... I will end the uh, episode here for today's episode of Let's Play Autopath Traveler 2. When we come back, we will try getting our first of our traveling companions. I hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did and would love to see more, hit that like and subscribe button. Leave a comment if you want. Ring that bell to be notified when our next video comes out. This really helps my channel by a lot if you do all these things. We do new videos every Tuesday, Thursday, and occasionally Saturday and Sundays. Till the next video, this is Sword Archild, signing off. Have a good night, folks.